Asalaamu Alaikum. Welcome to my channel. Don't forget to subscribe and ring that bell for all the time so you wouldn't miss one video. Today we're going to talk about. Yes. In the Quran group test. Let's go see. Morning of Pharaoh. 1400 years ago nobody knew Egyptian hieroglyphs. With the final closing of pagan temples in the 5th century, knowledge of hieroglyphic writing was lost. Although attempts were made, the script remained undeciphered throughout the Middle Ages and the early modern period. The decipherment of hieroglyphic writing was finally accomplished in the 1820s by Jean-Francois Champollion, with the help of the Rosetta Stone. When hieroglyphs were finally deciphered they found out how Egyptians mourned their pharaoh. A pyramid text describing the dead pharaoh's fight for supremacy in heaven, says, The sky weeps, the stars shake, the keepers of the gods tremble and their servants flee when they behold the king rising up as spirit, as a god who lives on his fathers and possesses his mothers. It says that, the sky weeps, over the dead pharaoh. This was known recently, however this was portrayed in the Quran 1400 years before it was discovered. While describing the mourning of pharaoh, Quran 44-29 Neither heaven nor earth wept over them, nor were they reprieved. Neither heaven nor earth wept over them, here the Quran answers this claim found only in Egyptian hieroglyphs, 1400 years before it was deciphered. How could an illiterate man who lived 1400 years ago have known Egyptian hieroglyphs? The Christian Bible falsely claims that during the time of King David they paid for the temple 10,000 gold derricks which turned out to be coins struck by King Darius 400 years later 1 Chronicles chapter 29 verse